interest groups in child rights issues say if you look at children uh, you could predict the future of a nation now what that means is that children are the future of any developing nation like Nigeria. So the extent of opportunities and encouragement provided for these children will determine the level of social economic development a country will attain. Now I have with me uh, the Minister for Women Affairs and Social Development, Iyom Josephine Aneni. Looking at our children, where do you think we are going in terms of provisions of health and, edu and education? The rights of children this government will protect to the hilt. Education for our children, provision of basic education for our children, their health care, uh, uh, the government is uh, leaving no stone unturned to make sure that our children do not even die before they reach the age of five in infancy. So we are fighting all preventable uh, childhood diseases with all the resources that we have. What we are trying to do today is celebrating uh, uh, in a March pass. I think we, the children, uh, we are bringing them up to meet with the challenges of the future. So I think we are moving in the right direction. Even the showers of blessing are seen by many people here as part of the unique features of today's Children's Day celebration. Now, today is very, very unique here. As the minister uh, pointed out earlier on, not principally because it's a day that precedes the inauguration of a Nigerian president that is widely accepted by everyone, irrespective of religion, tribe, or tongue. Now, this is an indication that the omens for the future success of Nigerian children and Nigerian nation are very, very good. It's back to your studio.